Yo, new channel today. So we're back here for another banger, guys. So the other day, I actually got the W on the Georgetown Sixes on the sneakers app. So that's pretty cool. Really like the shoe. But today, I'm gonna teach you how to lace them up in a different way. Let you know my honest opinion on the shoe, what I think of it, and of course, it on feet, so you guys can see the shoe in person. So before we get into the video, guys, make sure to follow me on my socials. They're gonna be here on the side. And let's get right into this video. Let's get it. Zombie Alright guys, first things first is the box. This is a different type of box. Never ever had this box in my life, not gonna lie. Made it come out more, made it pop out. Look at that. It came in a nice box, a nice six box too. Very nice box. All the designs on there too. Look at that. Let's get close. It's the box. The front. All that good stuff. Oh yeah. I got Mike right there. But, and let's get to the shoe real quick. I'm gonna show you two ways right now. I'm gonna show you the factory way and the way I laced it. I have one in here already laced the way it is to show you the difference in the style and how they look. So this right over here is going to be a regular shoe. Yeah, this is going to be the one I list up. Alright, so. Let me look at the box already. Nice paper in there too. It's like regular black paper. I bet. Perfect. Let's put these both side on side. Side to side. Look at that. Alright guys, I'm pretty sure you know which one is the one I laced up. This is how I have them right now. Exactly like this. So, the one on your... Things your left is the factory way, as you can see right here. It's the factory way. You see the lace lock all the way on top right there. Just like that. Look at how icy is at the bottom. Shush. And this over here, so I released it. Made it look different. Look at that. It looks just nice. And you got the little laces out here. And you have more room for your feet. Because it's loosened up. As you can see, loosened up there. As in the other the factory way, it's not loosened up. It's tight, like crazy. And this one, you don't lace it up the way you want it. Yeah, so it's different. Got both of the shoes for your second side. Put them up. So it's different real quick before we go into lacing them. So after this, guys, I'm going to relace the shoe, the other one for you guys. So you see how you do it the way I did it. And I'm teach you my way. Let's get it. Oh right, guys, so you got both the shoes right here. Got the other one next to it, so you can see how it is. So, explaining it real quick. As you can see, we got from the first loop that we have right here. We got one, two, three. So after we go from the second one right here, so you know there's one, two, and then you go to the third one right here. This is where we're going to place the lace lock. And we're going to do it a certain way. So, first things first, already, you guys already know. Make sure your laces are equalized and the same length. There we go. So, that's as good right now. Looks perfectly fine. Fix it a bit, though. Fix it a bit. Because I don't like that spot. So, it looks a little bit raggedy, you know, just fix it a bit. Make it look better. Perfect right there. I right, bet. So for things first, go through it, but go over it, go over the shoe and then inside, in out, from the outside in, something like that, exactly like this, perfect, same thing over here, over here, go like that, put it in, perfect like that. Alright, and one little thing, make sure you have like a little bit of space. So you can have looseness, so we're gonna go like that a little bit. There you go. And always make sure they're the same length still. As you go. But it's still the same length. So that's that first one right there. We still don't put the lace lock until the third. The third one. But but let's get it. Next one right here. Go like this. 
Boom. Boom like that. It's perfectly fine right there. Perfect. Next thing, go like this. Okay, move this shoot a little bit to the side a little bit right here. Okay. Go like this. Perfect right there. So guys, okay, so this is the second one right here. So make sure they're equalized again. Go like that. Stretch out the shoe a bit like this. Perfect like that. Perfect. Okay. So we have like that right now, okay? So next thing, we're gonna grab our lace lock right here. Make sure the jump man is facing down like this. Make your face down like that, as you can see it, just like in the other one, just like that. And I want to put the lace through the lace lock. Okay, so first one, go like this. And this will be straightened out, make sure that like, they, get, they get stacked onto each other. So we got our first one right here, right in the middle. Okay, then we got to get the next one right here. Back inside like that. Stack them a bit, stack them, stack them. Hold up, and if it's kind of crooked, fix it. Do it the other way. There we go. It's perfectly fine like that. Now we do that, pull them a bit. Make sure they're in a good angle, make it look nice. Just like that. And now, inside like this, the next hole. Same thing over here. Just like that. Easy, and it looks nice. Now just to make it look nicer, we already know we gotta fix it. Go like this, gonna pull it, play with it a little bit, make it look straightened out, just like that. It actually looks good. Nice. Nice. I really like how it looks, not gonna lie. Boom. Perfection. So for these next ones guys, we're gonna go under this tongue right here, as you can see, this Jordan tongue. This fabric Jordan tongue right here, we're gonna go under the lace this time. So we can hide the lace, start hiding the lace now. Because we, we, we do want to show that, so now. So underneath like this, and put in the lace through. Through it. It's kind of hard, not gonna lie. That's why we gotta do it right. Keep doing it. Like that. That's pretty good. Right there. Perfect. Now the other side. Make sure it's straightened out. Okay, so like this. Other side. Go under the tongue. And go through all the way. And then grab it from the other side. Oh, this is actually hard. Not gonna lie. There we go. Okay. Ooh. See how it looks nice now? It keeps looking nice. It keeps looking better and better. Now, put in the next lace, of course, you already know. Go like this. Go like this. And the same thing with for this lace. Do the same thing. To get to the other side. And go under the tongue again. Under the tongue. I'll do that for this one first. Grab it good. Like this. And go under the tongue again. Hug that lace. Perfect, right there. Same thing for the other one. Go like this. Grab that lace. I'm gonna go through first. No, I'll go through after. Like this. Go like that. Ah. Go. Gotta go grabbing it. Ooh, good thing I have small fingers for this. I don't lie. If not, it'd be hard. It'd be hard. I'm not even going to lie to you. But this is it. Going through the other hole. That's right here, literally. And go through the other one over here. And you see no lace. 
She come out like this a bit. Oh no, we gotta come out from right here. I just messed up a bit. Hold up guys, let's go back. There we go. So, I was supposed to go through here, I was supposed to go through over here. Coming out now. Cause there's an in and out way. I forgot about that. So I'm gonna pull it out real quick. I right, bet. And I'll go towards the top. My bad. I got an angle. So go here still. But get out through an angle over here. Yep, like that. Exactly like this. Yep. So how I got over here. Same thing for the other one. Could have had an angle. So go to the other point. Time right over here. Go like this. Perfect. That's way better. Okay, gotta fix this. This is not straightened out. There, that's way better. Straightened out and everything. Perfect. And you already know, the last hole. Going like this. Like that. And then over here, same thing. Over here, it's already in. You can see, look at that. Right here. So we go in like this. Like that. Make it look nice, you already know. We all make it look nice. Make it look clean, you know, make it look clean. There you go. And then, you already know, right here it's unclipped. So put in your last laces, like that. And like that, so they stay in a good fashionly order. Make it look clean. Okay, clip it. It's in there already. Clipped. And, Throw outside now. Right here. Same thing over here. Just like that. They're both the same now. Yes, sir. Look at that. Look how nice that looks. You know, like that does not look nice. Got it clean. Now guys, I'm going to show you on, on feet, outside, let's get it. So I'm gonna let you know my honest opinion on the shoe, what I think of it, the colorway and everything, and what you can do with to make different outfits with the shoe. Okay, so you can see guys, it's that light gray with that nice navy blue tint on the side with the icy bottom with the jump man. Look at that jump man under there, jump man on the side right here, and just the colorway for the shoe makes it easy to make different type of outfits because they match it with any type of neutral color. And there's many neutral colors you can combine with this shoe right here. So you can't go wrong with white, black, or gray with this shoe. And even some khakis will look nice with this, not gonna lie, like some khaki jeans look really nice with this shoe. And a nice like, let's say a gray, light gray, uh, a light gray like bomber jacket or a bomb jacket or any type of jacket you like, any type of style you prefer in your opinion. But yeah, I'll give this shoe a 10 out of 10 because I really like the colorway, easy to match different out outfits with, make different outfits, and it's just a unique shoe. Really like it, guys. Love it. And I already showed you guys how to lace the shoe. They're both laced the same way now, as you can see. Nice and loose, the way they look right here. Love it, not gonna lie. Look at that. Fire. But yeah, guys. 
go crazy. Ooh, one. Okay, guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Learn how to lace your shoe in a new way. And I hope you guys make some nice outfits, some nice neutral color outfits with black, white, khaki, or any color that you can match gray with, light gray. And of course, navy blue is easy to match with because it's like a dark blue. Really like a, that's what I really like about the shoe, not gonna lie. The mm, beautiful Georgetown's. Georgetown's stickers are beautiful, not gonna lie. But before we go, guys, make sure to follow me on my socials. Socials are gonna be here on the side. You already know. And if you guys enjoyed the video, you already know, give that like button and subscribe to the channel. Go Neutral Fam, and thanks for watching.